right. The third month, the 14th day, 3.14. That is, of course, the mathematical formula known as pi, or at least a part of it. So, of course, math nerds like me across the world have decided to make it a holiday. We never pass up a reason to celebrate. So, Lisa Van Gammer from American Menza is here to talk about some fun ways to acknowledge the day and some things we can do with your kids on spring break to celebrate math. Welcome. Thank you so much. Nice to be here. 3.14159265358. Oh. Yeah. You're in. That's on my prompter, by the way. I have no <laughs> idea. <laughs> That is pie, and you're going to show us some cool things to do with it. Let's start with yeah. the t-shirts first, because those need a little time. They do. We're going to demonstrate a couple activities. Glad you've got your apron on, because we're going to use some bleach. What you're going to do is, you can print out the pie symbol on our website, us.mensa.org, and then you just cut the symbols out. So you're left with kind of a reverse stencil. So what I want you to do is slide the foil. Right, putting this inside. Right, in between the two layers of the shirt. This is, by the way, I saw this earlier when you were demonstrating it. This is so much easier than tie-dyeing. It is it's so, so much quicker. Easy. I love this idea. You can do this with anything, but why not do it for pie because it's exactly. National Pie Day. Yeah. All right, so, so you take this, exactly. you take your reverse stencil. Lay, and lay it down on the shirt anywhere you want. Right there. Okay, great. Now you've got a magical mix. formula. Exactly. 50% bleach, 50% water. And if you want real clarity of your symbol, you want the lines real sharp, you can spray down vertically. So okay. go ahead. So go straight down. Yeah. And just lightly spray your gray. And I'm going to get enough. that symbol everywhere but where the pie cut out Exactly. Is. All right, we're going to let those bleach away for a little while. You're going to yeah. do yours at a little more angle to make it kind of yeah. more... More vague. And if you want to make it grunge, like the shirt we made for you, nice. do it in a stream rather than the spray. Okay, you'll very get this smart. Look for the teen nerd. Yes, the cool, the, the cool, the cool teen nerd. pie yes. fan. But All we right. did a spray for your cupcakes. Oh, the Amy, you're the one too. Awesome. You're the one too. All right, let's start with the cupcakes because you're going right. to make some pie cupcakes. And while you're mixing in the ingredients, uh, okay. we're going to have the, all the web, uh, the ingredients on the website, so we don't need okay. to go into details. But all right. Talk about, first of all, what pi is, for people that don't know. Well, pi is the ratio between the circumference of a circle all the way around. That's the outside. That's the outside, exactly. And the diameter of the circle, or the way across. And the that, diameter. very nice. Are you sure you're not in Mensa? I am not, but I want to apply, just because I think it would be really cool to say I was a Mensa member. Exactly. I actually think Amy is smarter than me, so I've always been afraid to do the intelligence <laughs> test on air. <laughs> all right, so now, we're, we're continuing this recipe, which is a simple, straightforward recipe. Straightforward. Easy that you can do with your kids. Exactly. And it ends up tasting like sugar cookies. Cookies, which very is a nice. great thing for kids. So it's a very simple recipe. And you just mix the dry ingredients first and then the wet ingredients. And then once this is mixed, you add your eggs and you're set. All right, let's talk about some of the things that are happening to celebrate Pi Day. You've got a list right. of like 13 things we can do with our families. Well, 14, 14. because 3.14, right? All on our website. And it's great for spring break, lots of things to do. So once you've baked your cupcakes, you can decorate them by putting the pie symbol on them with things you have around. I have hot tamales, mini chocolate chips, M&Ms, but you, we also have lots of activities, stringing beads, um, paper chains, 14 activities, great for spring break. All right, before I let you go, I have to say, you are a huge fan of pie, so much so... Your son was born on Pi Day. It's his 16th birthday right there. There's Yay. Joseph. Give us a wave, Joseph. Happy birthday, sir. Yeah. All right, and these are working away very well. I'm going to do the big reveal, and then we'll cut back over to Amy. There it is. You can see our Pi T-shirt is starting to have its symbol there. Celebrate math the way only cool kids can exactly. with your very own Pi T-shirt and the cupcake recipe that is on our website. Thanks so much for being Thank here. Thank you so much. Happy Pi Day. Amy? Good stuff, Rob.